Hey guys, Darkstar here for the Castcraft AU Tournament. And I'm drinking beer, because what makes casting more fun? Drunken and disorderly behaviour. This is game one on Searing Crater between Tony and Photo King. Tony is playing Zerg as his race choice, and Photon King is playing as Protoss. So, uh, we're still in round three. This is the fourth game out of the round three in the winner's bracket. Um, by the time I start saving this one, uh, we should I should have uploaded the uh, last game I just casted about 10 minutes ago, which was between uh, Roxas and Black Market. Wow, your memory just disappears so fast. So we have Tony going uh, onto a fast gas, gas first by lots of things, gas first spawning pool, maybe some ling speed. Photon King looking like he's going to uh, try and block a uh, fast expand. And oh, oh, pushed away by the drone. Fail. But he's got his wall up, so it's all good. Metabolic boost coming out for Tony. Tony scouting with his overlord to cross positions. Uh, that's his only scout so far. He's been focusing on income, using uh, not giving away that scouting drone. Because uh, every minute that the scouting drones away, it's 40 minerals, I believe. So, uh, yeah, for what's been. Probably send a scout on two minutes, so three minutes now. So he's scouting with Ling. So, yeah, uh, it's 120 extra minerals if he, because he didn't scout. So, it you know, it gets you to have tree pretty fast. So it's not a bad idea. Photo King looks like he's going to have a drone out, here, a probe out here, just for a bit of a proxiness. Link coming up, checking around. Sentry doing a job instead of moving the, the zealot out. Overlord spotting. Bit of transition there. Got a roach one coming out for Tony. Two extra gateways coming out for Photon King. Pushing out, maybe a little bit of harass. Proxy pylon. Okay, so he's got four zealots and two sentries. Bringing up another probe for some more proxy action. Roaches on the way, that's a lot of lings. Still a lot of lings. You may want to cancel that. Cancel, good choice. Ducking away and retreating. Overlord watching out on that side and watching that side. Tony playing quite well. Ooh, hidden tech. Tech at the back of a Twilight Cancel. So maybe some uh, the Zealot legs, I guess. It's good against the Roaches. Roaches moving out. Looks like we have a little bit of an engagement here. Zealot's pushing back. Tony holding complete map control at the moment. Ah, went behind Dark Shrine. Ah, typical Protoss play. But we all love it. We love seeing the DTs come out. Zealous looking like they're on a bit of a patrol. Sacrificial Zealous coming out to see what's happening. Um, road speed, by the way. Link's coming up. Zealous coming out. They're just in time to save it. Ooh. Attack from both sides. Go, go Roaches! Nice, nice movement by Tony. Link's coming out trying to break in. No, they're going after the probes. Wow, he might have denied it. Four DT's coming out and as far as I remember there was no detection. I didn't see anything. Did you guys see anything? No. Looks like the DT's going to push back the Roaches and Link's. There are some links in here. Trying to snipe the pylons. Well, that should pop them, push them back. DT's coming in. Oh, they're going to do some damage. Detection coming in. Oh, oh. And they're taken out. But, uh, yeah. A couple of drones lost. Uh. No, <laughs> I can't remember which one it is. Um, Nineteen hundred resources. He only really lost some lings, and uh, but yeah, look at the difference. Big, big difference. 
Lots of units taken out by those roaches. Let's go back to production. The Robo Bay coming out. So we got DT's possible Robo Bay. With all the roaches, maybe we'll see some Colossus play. Tony looking to take a third. Decent creep spread. Using the Overlord, very nice. Helping get his next queen down there if he is building another queen on the way. No. We've got a Lair Tech, we've got a Proxy Hatch, we've got plus one plus one going down. Roach is coming around for another attack. Take another cannon. Nice trap there. Roach is doing that part, being annoying. So this is what we call back and forth action. It's like they're doing a tango. Back and forth. So fourth hatchery down, reclaiming that gas. So the overlord that was backed away that was here. And there it is, robotics bay on the way. So we're gonna see some Colossus to combat the um, roaches. Ooh, trying to take out that overseer. Only your server. <laughs> Grew spines, that needs some hydras, and there they are, 15 hydras. So we're going straight out, damage dealing, roach and hydra mix. So a uh, Colossus, wonderful choice against those two. Oh, sniped. Other DTs, looks like it's going to go some scouting. And pathogen glands, so maybe some infestors as well. Plus two, plus two coming out, more overseers on the way. Good for protection. Taking out the rocks. More back and forth action. See how the attack goes. Oh, nice. Blocking a few of the roaches and hydras in there. Take him out. Oh, wonderful, look at that. Really blocked that one up. Burrow on the way, burrow almost finished. Well, we burrow done. Uh, more roaches and you might be able to duck under the force fields. Overlord over here, still not detected. Creep spreading in the middle, very nice. Extended Thermal Lance. DT, taken out. Might have got a few kills out of DT. First Colossus on the field. Zealots, do they have legs? No they don't, no blinker either. Still that Overlord hasn't been detected. Running out of minerals on the main, so we're pretty much mining off two bases now. Ah, protected, and down it goes. But using that as a distraction to get in the other side, very nice. Very good play by Tony. My computer's lagging. Oh, I know why. Um, yeah, if you hear a ding, it means that the save file for the last um, cast uh, uh, is complete. So yeah, sorry about the lag. I'm trying to multitask here on my crappy old computer. A wave of pink coming out. Looks like he's looking to take the gold as well. Come on, ding. Save that file. Five infestors on the way. Another hatchery. Hatchery here and hatchery here and hatchery here. Mass hatcheries, mass units. Okay, so we got Adrenal Gland and plus three on the missile attacks. Very nice. Spy going down as well. Possibly going some corruptors to combat the um, Colossus. Death Ball looking pretty strong, 158 to 125. Looks like Tony's going to have to try and dance back and forth. Push that uh, Death Ball back until he can get some uh, Corruptors. And there they are, nine Corruptors on the way. Taking over expansion at top. Lots of bases, look at it all. Big map control. That guy's still sitting there. Other base coming down and going for a greater fire. So possibly uh, using those corruptors if they're not so useful. Same as Bane Lord. Bane Lord. Brood Lords. We mix up all the words. It's fail casting. <laughs> uh, Death Ball pretty strong. Plus three coming close to Zealot Leg Speed. See, I heard that ding. Did you guys hear that ding? That means one of the files is saved, which means that's going to be up on the channel very soon. I might upload that as well as the other two games you can save them before it gets too late yeah, I could probably save another game upload them in the morning 
Hey, we have some broodlords on the way. An interesting mix over here, and Cropsers have full uh, mana. Energy. I played too much WoW. Uh, full energy! Death Ball sniping. Death Ball's probably waiting for it. Plus three, wow, epic. Plus three ground. So both sides have upgraded, both sides have capped. We'll slow this down and see how the battle unfolds. Some fungal growth links to the adrenal glands. Broodlord is doing their worst. Units been walking out at the back. Roach is pushing underneath. That thermal ant hitting all those hypers looking at more melt. Corrupt is coming forward to take out the Colossus. Broodlord still doing the damage to the front. We yeah, have these uh these corruptors made the game by taking out the Colossus. Yeah. Well, GG guys, um, I'm going to get on to the next game and try and get out as many games as possible so we can get on with this competition because it's getting really exciting now. It's in the exciting stages. I'll see you guys in the next game. It's been Darkstar for the Cast Craft AU tournament.